Welcome to Rune Factory 5, where we are once again getting into a new day, day 12 of winter. Let's begin it like we always do by um, clearing out the debris and uh, caring for our plants and monster friends. After that, we'll go and ask Lucas out on our third date. Huh. All right. And uh, also huh. Huh. need to remember to visit nice. the uh, special stump and uh, see if there's an orange tree seed yes! there for us. All right. All right. Oh, and uh, of course, another thing we want to do today in this episode is to um, put some enhancements um, huh. on our new sword. Nice. The one that we made huh. at the end huh. of our previous episode. Huh. The one huh. that is hopefully huh. powerful enough nice. Nice. that we can defeat the yellow dragons huh. with it. Huh. Yes! Oh, all right! I've thought about it and I think I do nice. want to dedicate the episode after this one to uh, adventuring in the maze and seeing if we can defeat those yellow dragons yet. It's a long sword, so its attacks will be uh, slower than I would like. But it's the only weapon that we currently have access to that, according to the internet, should be powerful enough to defeat the yellow dragons. So um, we'll see about that in the episode after this one. And um, hopefully we will be able to defeat those yellow dragons. All right. There we go, all the uh, herbs in there. Again, there's something going on in the flower shop. Well, we'll tend our um our fodder here and then we'll look after the monster friends and then we'll go see what's happening in the flower shop grow big and strong okay All right, those have been watered. Let's go and do the brushing. Five per day, 228. That's good for quite a few days. Yes. No need to yes. worry about having to there, sow there. more fodder there, seeds there. yet. I think 
in the next episode there, there. we are just going there, to take there. our dragons with there, us there. into there, the maze there. but in the future episodes we'll see if um if we'll take lucas um, instead of one of our dragons Because we do want to increase that friendship level with Lucas. So yeah. Nice, nice. Maybe once we've been there, on three there. dates with him, there, there. we'll start taking him along there, there. on our adventures. Make a there, party there. of two dragons and uh, Lucas and ourselves, of course. I think that sounds pretty good. There, Let's there. see here. One. There, there. Two. There, there. Three. There, there. I think that was all of them. And then we just have one more monster bond left. I think we have a dark crystal to use on our new sword, so we should nice. be able to just uh, make it dark there, there. without going there, uh, there. hunting for another there, crystal. There. And then of course we want to um, add the poison to it and the holy spore. And as for other stuff, well, we'll see. I have heard that the four leaf clover can increase your luck. But I don't know if it needs to be like... Um... Forged into a weapon or a piece of armor or something in order for it to work or if you just need to carry it in your inventory. I guess uh, just to be on the safe side we could forge it into our weapon. Alright, let's go see what's happening at the flower shop this time. Um, it was here. Right? Yeah, I guess it's inside. Welcome, darling. Hello, Hazel. Are you here to buy some flowers? Maybe do a little shopping? Or are you in the mood for something else? Like me, perhaps? Good to see you're as cheerful as ever, Ludmilla. On the contrary, how can I possibly be happy when you're not around? But... And even though we've been separated for such an agonizingly long time, you seem to be doing just fine. You didn't forget about me, did you? Not at all. Hmm? 
the real Z's? Oh, I know. I'll do a reading. Huh? What kind of reading? I'll ask the flowers what you think of me. The number of petals will say something about our relationship. Good or, or bad. Average, destined, passionate or indifferent. Now, which flower should I use? Choose one, Hazel. Um, let's go with Pink Cat. Good, bad, average, destined, passionate, or indifferent? <laughs> passionate! Really? You love me, Hazel? And I love you! Thank you! <laughs> the pleasure is all mine. You know, this is a pretty unusual way of telling fortunes. Did you come up with it yourself, Ludmilla? Uh-uh. No, an acquaintance of mine taught me how to do it a long time ago. But who knows how this will turn out. If the gods really do exist, I wonder if they'll yell at us for redoing fortunes just because we didn't like the result. I doubt it. I love the idea of us taking charge of our own destinies. <laughs> And I love you, Hazel, more than anything in the whole wide world. Uh, not what I was talking about, but oh well. Whatever makes her happy. No. That was sweet. Um, oh, she's at the back. Ludmilla? Do you know anything about dried flowers? You preserve them to immortalize their beauty. But dried flowers don't actually live longer, since they're already dead. It's almost a little morbid, right? Ugh. Kinda like me. I'd rather die young and leave a beautiful corpse than slowly wither and fade away. Well, I mean, that's just another kind of beauty, you know, to live a long life. It's not the flower that people want to preserve, but rather their memory of it. We'll all pass away someday, so what matters most is how people remember us. Thanks. Huh, interesting. That makes sense. Thanks, Hazel. I'm glad we had this talk. Well, I'm glad Same. too. Oh, um, you wanna go adventuring with me? Um, I guess we could hang for the remainder of, um... Yay! 
Well, maybe not for the remainder of this episode, but like for a while at least. Let's go see Lucas together. Oh, right, in this game you can't jump over the fences. Lucas, um, I have some udon for you. Fascinating, is it not? This is splendid. Also, however. Oh, we had this discussion um, hmm. earlier. So, would you like to go on a date with me? You'd like to go on a third date. It'll be a joyous occasion indeed. This time, I have a request for you. What is it? I'll tell you the details during our date. Please meet me tomorrow evening at 8 p.m. by Lake Melody. A request to fulfill by Lake Melody in the evening. Yes. Okay. I'll see you there at 8 p.m. Wonderful. I look forward to it. So it is tomorrow, right? Not today? Probably. That is. Ah, uh, we've had this talk before. <laughs> Would you like some pickles? Oh. We could go and uh, see about that tree seed. Let's just, um, wrong button. Let's just wear the rosary for that. Yeah, I think I want to, want to take my dragons with me into the maze in the next episode and then just tell the yellow dragon to hang back when uh, when there's a fight that involves other yellow dragons the yellow dragons are hard enough to kill as it is i i uh don't Oh, hello, apple tree seed. Nice. I don't want my yellow dragon healing the other yellow dragons. Uh, Ludmilla, I don't have a flower for you at the moment. But... Let's see. How would you like some... Um, cheese fondue. Um, let's go back home and then I guess we could split up there.
Oh, are you okay? I don't think I've ever used this option. Ooh la la, you're worried about me, aren't you? <laughs> Relax, I'm totally fine. Aw, I wonder if that increased my friendship with her. Well, anyway. Let's go and um, put the apple tree seed in here. Yeah, there we go. And I think it's time to start leveling up our sword. So, upgrade. And um, the... Uh, Steel Slicer. Let's see about that Four Leaf Clover. It doesn't say anything. Carry it around or make it a gift and happiness will follow you. Make it a gift. That does kind of, um, say that we should just carry it in our pocket or our inventory when we go adventuring. But, uh, just in case. It's just one level, just one kind of a missed um, opportunity to put in some additional effects and just in case it actually does nothing at all. Additional fatigue resist would be nice, but um, nah, that's too difficult. Hmm, holy spore. Yeah, those um attacks are um the poison seal and um and paralyze are pretty great and let's add some more poison This would be nice. <laughs> Unfortunately, too difficult. Um, sick attack. Oh yeah, we need to do this to make it dark. What else? Ooh, more seal attack. Better chance that the monsters won't be able to use their magic after being hit by us. Obviously, probably won't work on bosses. I think we want 
the resistances, right? We already have them in in our armor, I think. And if we're going to be using this sword in the maze, where um where the enemies do have like special attacks that have the uh, special status effects or that have like a chance to inflict a status effect then I think we do want good resistances as good as possible I think it may actually be worth using this broken box a second time yeah I know it's not as powerful when when used a second time but good enough ah uh, not going to use it at third time though the uh third time is going to add so little to the stats that it it's not going to be worth it mm. this would be nice but like difficulty 80 a bit too much Nice resistances. Hmm. More crit resist would be nice too. What do we want to add? I don't think like a few points of attack is going to do much at this point. Um, but adding strength would add more attack. Yeah. So I guess that's it. That's what we are going into the maze with in the next episode. Uh, no events? Nope. And uh, today is not yet the day of our date, so we can just hang out in the maze as, um, as long as we want. Yeah. This looks pretty good. We'll, um, equip it. And, um, then I guess there's nothing else to do but to save the game here and end the episode. And then in the next episode, we'll, we'll go and get our dragons into the party with us. And, um, then we'll go and see what we can accomplish in the maze. For now though, thank you so much for spending time with me here on the Mellow. It was lovely to have you. Please remember to be kind to yourself. Have a lovely rest of your day. And I'll see you next time.